<laughs> welcome to a beautiful jungle it is sunday december 10th um we just got back not just got back like an hour and a half two hours ago but i need to do some meal preps do some meal preps and do some juice for the week So right now I'm prepping all of my um, vegetables, red onions, and I still had some red onions left over from my harvest from 2023. Well, this video was done in 2023. I'm now doing it in 2024. <laughs> so we have red onions, red bell pepper, um, yellow pepper. And I'm just slicing them up. All of this is going to go into our ground chicken and ground sausage mix. I had my um, fruit soak in it in cold water with baking soda. So I'm just using, I finally got a um, fruit and vegetable scrub brush. And I am just scrubbing off all the dirt off the beets, the ginger, and the lime that's in there. And I'm just showing you guys the dirt that came off of the vegetables. Um, do you think you could see it better if I didn't cut the beets? But I did cut the beets. Um, baking soda really works. So please make sure you wash all your fruits and your vegetables. And we are doing cauliflower rice instead of regular rice. Um, I have a bowl with my cheesecloth and um, the cauliflower, it's microwavable, so I stuck it in the microwave for six minutes and let it cool a little because I will be squeezing it by hand. So that's two bags of cauliflower. Later on, I did end up adding some more cauliflower because we needed more because I was cooking for myself and my husband. So just squeeze all of that liquid out because I want it to be like rice and not like mashed potatoes <laughs> which cauliflower mash is really delicious garlic butter cauliflower mash is delicious so now i'm adding it to my pan i ha have some avocado oil in there the pan was heating up you see how nice and crumbly that is dry i, I am going to add some um seasoning to that some italian seasoning some garlic powder onion powder, black pepper, and salt. I had to learn that just because I am on a weight loss journey and changing the way I'm eating does not mean that my food shouldn't have any flavor in it. Season your food how you would like. Be conscious of the sodium in the seasoning. So use more fresh seasoning, more fresh herbs and things like that. And also Tabata Brown has um, seasoning that is sodium free. I use it. It's delicious. So season your food the way you like it. So we, I added in my peppers, onions, garlic. The garlic, I think I, sh I, did, I did do a video on how I preserve garlic. I minced up the garlic and then I added olive oil to it. So we're going to just mix everything up. I made a mess. It wouldn't be my kitchen if I didn't make a mess. I made a mess, <laughs> a little spillage. And now I'm gonna, just going to put the cover on there and let it just cook and soften the vegetables. So now let's move on to our, this is the kidney detox. And it's uh, watermelon, beet, mint, ginger, and lime. I doubled because both myself and my husband are going to be are going to be drinking this. So I did I did um my beets separate because I want to keep the pulp pulp from the beet and put it into smoothies. I'm going to dehydrate I'm actually going to dehydrate it. Yes, and turn it into a powder. So that's me 
I was showing you guys that. And I'm putting it in a different container. And every time I juice my beets, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to dehydrate it and put it in smoothies. I will have the recipe for this kidney detox um, in the description. There's also a liver detox and a colon detox. And I'm really, I, I am really enjoying juicing. I really am. And, but you know, the one that I really enjoy <laughs> is the green juice. The one I did with the celery, kale, spinach, lime, green apple. I am really enjoying that one. Um, I do enjoy the beet juice because it does give you the energy that you need and, you know, all that wonderful stuff. But the green juice, I really like the green juice. I also did a um, pineapple juice, pineapple and celery juice. That was good. But I'm allergic to pineapples. And I, <laughs> I thought if I juice it, it would be different. But I was drinking it at work. And I'm like, why am I itching? Why is my throat itching? Why is my skin itching? And I'm, tr and I'm like, oh, my God. My eyes, it's under my eyes. They were turning red. And I was getting whelps under my eyes. I'm allergic to pineapple. I can't have pineapple. So I have, I was having a little malfunction here going on with my, um, with my juices. So, oh, my husband came in to try to see what he can do to fix it. So he's just doing his husband thing. He moving it around like he actually doing something. <laughs> he wasn't. <laughs> Let me stop. <laughs> he wasn't. Anyway, we just went on with our merry way. <laughs> he was like, it is what it is. <laughs> so, yeah. So what was I saying? I have two, actually two pineapples on the, um, on my counter waiting to be juiced. I am going to end up juicing it, but I think I'm going to juice it and do, um, like, icicles for the kids icy pops for the kids because i have those things that i can use it with also yeah I, I think i'm gonna do that or try to do some pineapple ice cream or something the kids can eat no problem you see how it keeps popping up i don't know what's going on i don't know what's going on but this is a compact a mini juicer so it's giving what it's giving so I was able to get seven um, meal preps done and my mixed mesh containers. <laughs> I ran out of cauliflower rice, but we did have more sausage and ground chicken um, meat mixture, but I ran out of cauliflower rice. Also, I got five 12 ounce jars of um the containers, those containers you saw, 12, um, five 12 ounce of those. And they were, del and it, it was very delicious. It really was. It was delicious. The meals were delicious and everything. So I hope you guys do try it. We are in the new, in, in our new year, 2024. What was that old saying we used to say? New year, new me. <laughs> so I started in 2023. I did a kickstart. So 2023 I didn't grow that much cucumbers so 2024 I am seeing as how I'm I started juicing and I found another way of preserving cucumbers anyhow thank you guys for coming along I pray you had a blessed day and I pray that your your next day will be blessed as well thank you so much to my new subscribers and thank you to the ones who have been here with me from the beginning of my journey and you're still hanging in there with me. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.